Hemolysis is the most common reason chemistry samples are rejected. Often preventable, it occurs when red blood cells rupture and release their hemoglobin into the serum or plasma. Hemolysis imparts a red tinge to serum or plasma and interferes with the accuracy of many blood tests. Many factors can hemolyze a sample during collection, including drawing through vascular access devices, prolonged tourniquet application, improper needle placement, excessive pulling pressure on the plunger of the syringe, milking the site of a capillary puncture, and premature or excessive centrifugation. Hemolysis causes many analytes to be reported as falsely higher or lower than their actual concentration in the patient. In addition, Hemolysis also dilutes specimens when the liquid contents of red blood cells become part of the serum or plasma. Therefore, hemolysis has the potential to affect everything the laboratory might be testing for in the specimen. To avoid hemolyzing samples, collectors can adhere to the following practices. Avoid draws through IV cannulas and other vascular access devices. Avoid slow draws that come from improperly positioned needles. Avoid pulling too hard on the plunger of a syringe. Gently invert tubes instead of vigorously mixing. Avoid using 25 gauge needles or smaller. Pre-warm capillary beds prior to performing a skin puncture so that excessive squeezing or milking of a puncture site is not necessary and do not centrifuge samples at an excessive speed or before they are allowed to clot completely.